Britain is a crowded island of just over 64 million people, with immigration adding to that number at surging levels, according to the UK's Office of National Statistics. The government claims the European Union's freedom of movement rules. These stark figures uh, are deeply disappointing and we have been knocked off course in terms of our target as a consequence of EU migration. Opinion polls do suggest that immigration is a matter of high concern for the people in Britain. However, it's not a matter of simply rejecting all immigration. The impact of the Calais migrant crisis has given us one reason for driving illegal immigration to the top of people's concerns. In Britain, some believe illegal immigrants drive down wages. And to meet those concerns, the government plans new legislation to crack down on landlords and employers who give accommodation or work to illegal immigrants. While the government believes it will deter thousands of migrants, an immigration think tank says it will only work as part of a strategic plan. We don't know whether this is going to be effective. We don't know whether this will work. I think in some respects um, it will be seen as popular in, in that it does focus on illegal immigration, which is a public concern. Again, it will take time for us to actually see whether or not any of these proposals, if they're passed through Parliament, will actually work. We actually illegal there. immigration in Britain is a small proportion of the headline figure, and there are many in Britain who believe the government's ambition to reduce it by a third is doomed to failure. The British government's planned immigration law is regarded in some circles as draconian. However, the real test will be whether it works. Richard Bestick, CCTV, Piccadilly Circus, London.